Stop it. What the fuck is this? <laughs> Tom said it's a sewer. I don't know. But like this is the weird thing about living in an old area. Sometimes you're just walking and there's a, a twisted tea next to a bunker. Hey Laura, what do you got there? This is a morning medi meditation juice. It's nice. Got, it's got beets and shit in it. It's really good and gingery. It matches the vibe of today, but it's very cold. Thank you <laughs> for your time. <laughs> Look at all this moss. Wait, I'm a moss ball. <laughs> Just a moss ball drinking juice. <laughs> Nothing to see here. Ooh, did we want to grab any pine needles and pine cones while we're here? We totally should. For some spells. Yeah. I gotta zoom in on the moss. Yeah. <laughs> the color of the day today is orange, so we're gonna eat at the orange if they have the veggies still out. With your orange scrunchie orange and orange sweater. Huh? Oh, there's one. Ooh, that's a good. That's a great little pair of pine cones. Ooh, on, oh, that's perfect for a spell. Look at this. It also looks phallic. It's perfect. Should we throw them in the sack? Although, they're fragile. I just hold them for now. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, there's a bunch of pine cones. There's a bunch of little pine cones, yeah. They're so cute, too. Oh, perfect. Ooh. One's flipped upside down, but one's still up. Great porch views. Porch, porch, porch. What's up? That mushroom looks like a fetus. What the fuck? Oh my god. <gasps> Look at that thing. <gasps> the color of the day is orange. Oh my god. Does anyone know what this is? That is horrifying. Whoa. I'll get real close up for some texture. Oh, oh god. <laughs> Oh boy, it looks Can breaded. Can anyone identify this? It looks breaded. Is it chicken of the woods? Just really dirty? It does look like a chicken breast. Like a breaded chicken it breast. It legitimately could be chicken of the woods. I feel like they look like that kind of. Or is that a, is that called, is that an actual mushroom? Chicken of the woods? Yeah, no it is. Oh. Wait. What if someone just... <laughs> <laughs> what if someone just threw their KFC under the porch? And it has just like... But it's like radioactive still. It's like the McDonald's fries that never change. That's what KFC changes into Chicken of the Woods. Oh my god, in 30 years it becomes Chicken of the Woods. That's so funny. It just melts into the ground and then comes Chicken of the Woods. Right. That would be extraordinary. Do you want to eat? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be a really cute potential thumbnail. Nice. Awesome.
also, what's perfect is my socks are not only orange, but orange they have mushrooms. mushrooms. There's also a frog guy. Frog guy. His name is Jason Funderburger. Jason Funderburger. <laughs> He's no, not crazy. you, Jason Funderburger. <laughs> no. Oh my god. It's Jason. <laughs> right. So we went to our maybe one of our favorite breakfast places. They have good gluten free, and I sadly can't eat gluten, and I mourn the loss of it every day in my life. Okay. Um. I still got gluten. Oh, damn. Is that the fries? This is the large. It's our first time getting large fries. The whole Ooh, thing. I like can't even, I don't want to take out the whole thing. No, because it's gonna get cold fast too. We're gonna lose a bunch. They're already kind of cold, but they're still so good. Nice. I'm okay with it. And then, oh, here's your. Is that my muffin top? It's your gay muffin top. You want to show? Show the people at home. Look how gay it is. Fun rainbow. Gay. That's for after my breakfast sandwich. Here's... Because nothing goes with fries. Like a fun Betty muffin. <laughs> right? Here's your sand dough. Oh, I can scooch over too if you want more like bench space to... Oh, put stuff put your down. stuff on. Oh, that'd be... Yeah. And my breakfast burrito is in here. Nice. Okay. bin in the middle of the woods. <laughs> Completely normal. Why is this here? Just in the woods. <laughs> Washing, doing some laundry in the woods, I guess. Laundry. Washing in the woods. Washing in the woods. Washing in the woods. It seems to have hit an obstacle. Let's see how she fares. middle squelch. It's not too bad. No. It's deeper than you think it is. Yeah. This trail's a little flooded. It is winter. <laughs> and it's all thawed. It's 45 in the middle of winter, which, uh, it's not normal. No, but there's snow and ice and mush right now. We love the mush. We love the New England mush. Look at this New England mush oh, all around mush. you. Look at that. That right there? You mush. see it? That's mush. It's mush, all right. New England branded mush. You'll never find another. Mush. Mush. Mush.
beautiful and scenic. Mmm, look at the foam. Mmm. Like whipped look cream. Look at that, like insulation for your walls. They just, do you know they make insulation here? See, right at this very waterfall. People who aren't from New England, you might think that's snow. It's not. Look at that. It's insulation. That's, that's foam. You can see it building up. Look. Look at where I'm filming. Oh god, ew. That's so That cute. then becomes that. And you can see some over here too. Nice stale insulation. And there's, oh, there's some over here too. Oh, look at the color on that. That's like mossy foam. Wow. Oh yeah, it's like a... That's ghost horrifying. Yeah. Cool. So, this is our swamp. This is our swamp. And that is where we capture the swamp people. Swamp people. They're Actually, very don't, small. I don't know what that is. If anyone knows what that is, let us know. It's for the swamp people. Okay. That's where we send the swamp people. They're very small. Swamp jail. Obviously, I am dressed like one of those like really gross, like spongy, drippy mushroom fairy witches today. It's a good time though. Okay, so I am wearing these these mittens. Nice. And then this wool cowl from the 70s that's purple and red and pink. And then it has really nice snaps. And it does have a hood actually. Cute. And then wearing that with this sweater from Free People that has, <laughs> look at these sleeves, they're so fun. Hold on, now I gotta find, this is the problem, I have too much fabric, so when I'm like locked into it, it feels great, but now I'll try to put this back on. Armhole. Oh, <laughs> you got a taste of the hood. All right, back in, and then, I don't need that. I'm wearing this shirt. Nice. And then with this little crop that has like a high neck and it's long sleeved under here. There it is. With just my airy flare yoga pants and my fry boots that I thrifted a couple years ago. Underneath that, I have this cute little cropped hoodie from uh, Aerie with a kind of like flannelly, frilly little western shirt. It's also vintage. The hoodie also has like the perfect little thumb holes. Thumb holes! Thumb holes. Um, and then I got on my little brown Israeli shoes and my orange mushroom socks. And that's about it. That's a bit. I also got my rings and my little cancer necklace. And your hair clip, too. Oh, and my little sad flower. Hold She's on. so sad. She's so sad. Aww. <laughs> Poor I'm girl. I'm not, though. No. It helps me feel less sad when I see how sad she is. Yeah. <laughs> it sucks up all my sad energy out of my head. <laughs> she makes you feel better about your life. Exactly. <laughs> Cute. You look awesome. Yeah! Ooh! Get like some arm, get like some movement in it. Yeah! There you go. Cute! Yeah, my little airplane! My little windmill! Nice. Cute! Beaver tree. If you're in New England Beaver. and you see a tree, that looks like that. That was a beaver. And it looks like they cut it down before it could fall on its own. 
a beaver. So be on the lookout for beavers and beaver dams. If we find a dam, we'll show you. Maybe that's why they put the, the cage up. Oh, do you think that cage is for beavers? Or maybe there was a dam? Maybe. Because that looks like a nice spot to build a dam. Right, where the bridge is? Did yeah. they destroy the beaver dam to build a bridge? Probably. probably. I mean, that looks like an old beaver dam, probably. Yeah. And now it's all foamy. Now it's all foamy. But, beaver tree. Beaver tree. The more you know. Beaver tree, beaver tree, beaver, beaver, beaver tree. Do it. Go one more time. I mean, you're, this is just your first time doing this, you know? So there's no pressure one way or the other, it's just fun. You're just climbing around. Look at the size of this tree. How far do you think I can get by the end of summer? How far do I think you can get by the end of the summer? Yeah. Um, I'm gonna say to like, I'm pointing to it on, to like there, like to the knot. To that big tangle of knots. Um, we'll just see where the tree becomes like a massive stump. Oh, where like the trunk like splits into like five different... Yeah. Trees. Yeah. Where the super tree has six little baby trees. Welcome. To Good Morning America. Good Morning America. So it is obviously. Can I say fuck it? We'll do it live. Yeah. <laughs> fuck it. We'll do it live. Fine. <laughs> so we are drinking coffees out of the mugs that we got from the place that we stayed after our wedding before we went to our honeymoon. Cute. They they had goats. Ooh, I can be in your cold. I'm put it a little bit closer. Are you gonna be in the mug? Yeah. I'm your coffee. <laughs> 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 so, um, we planned yesterday, we were gonna, we were like, oh, we're gonna be home around like two to three, get home, do some more cleaning, do some homework and stuff. That didn't happen. We got home at like seven. So, had a great day though. We did. We ended up, we were like, we're gonna go to the thrift store for like 10 minutes, like three hours later. Don't go to the thrift store with her. Don't do it. <laughs> Unless you want to be there all day. She tells you that you can put time limits on things. There is no time you limit. You didn't even give me a time limit for the record. <laughs> so you didn't, it's your fault you didn't keep me in line. Um, okay. So we went to the thrift store instead of doing work that we needed to do. And that's okay. Um, treat yourself. We had a yourself. lot of fun. Treat yourself. It was a good time. Treat yourself. Um, but... Even then, we got signs from the universe that we had to be um, changing shit up. There's some some big changes that we have been not making. So we've decided this week it's it's finally time to to do that. And you know what happened? I got a tarot card reading that I literally got death and rebirth. And. We watched Rocco's Modern Life, the movie special from... Static Calling. Yeah, Static Cling. Static Cling, is static that Static Cling. Okay. Um, that was really good, but literally the whole moral of it was you have to embrace change. Um, and then what was... Wasn't there a third? 
Oh, so earlier in the video, you saw us film a mushroom that looked like it was a uh, chicken of the woods. Oh, yes. And then last night when we got home, where did chicken, in the woods pop, chicken of the woods pop up? We were either, were we watching something? We oh, watching. no, it was a comic. Oh, it was a comic. There's a comic that I like that I've read for ages. Hi, Anthony. There's a comic that I've read for ages, and they just randomly mention Chicken of the Woods. Mm hmm So, as I told you, witchy shit, Anthony's here. He's present. Yeah, little pop-up. He's so cute. So, even though we chose to rest and not go to bed early, we still got more signs that we needed, and we listened to our bodies, we listened to the universe, we needed to get some extra rest, and we still got the signals that we needed. So, that's pretty cool. And I swear, I swear guys, we're listening, okay? We're doing it. We're gonna push ourselves this week. We're gonna do great. Yay! Okay, so, I hope everyone has a lovely day whenever you are watching this, and I'll see you in the next vlog. Say goodbye, Anthony. He's going right up to the camera. Look at him. Say goodbye, Bubble. This is Anthony Bubble, signing off. <laughs> nice. All right, turn it off. Stay tuned for a th uh, thrift haul, too. With Anthony, potentially. With Anthony. Should I'm we turn this? Eat fries now. I'm going to turn this off. Dark Knight Sky book. Is this not the witchiest thing? Oh my god, I cannot wait to have a black light room go and get it. I really want to get a black light for the witchy room. And like, imagine, imagine we're having a sleepover and we're both in really cute little vintage lingerie. And then I open this and I'm like, you want to see? You want to see something? And I'm like, oh, you want to see something? And you're like, yeah, obviously. And then I show you this book. And I open it, and it just starts lighting up, and it goes, ta -da! And then we...